Here are five key benefits for adding ceiling speakers in your home. We get loads of you getting in touch trying to decide if ceiling speakers are the right choice for your home. And although we have got a full ceiling speaker series for beginners on our channel, that is getting a little bit old now, so we're upgrading our content for you. Now we thought we'd kick off with the benefits to help you know whether ceiling speakers are worth considering, but do let us know what other videos that you'd find helpful. All right, let's jump straight into it and kick off with number five, and that is the clean aesthetic that you get from ceiling speakers. Now there's no denying how clean and aesthetic ceiling speakers look once they're in the ceiling. And all you see is this clean white grill that's also spray paintable so you can match the color of your ceiling and you won't even know it's there. All the magic is happening behind your ceiling and out of the way. Essentially, ceiling speakers don't take anything away from the room. Music will fit right into the background without you noticing, a bit like walking into a shop or a restaurant and you never really notice where the music is coming from. So if you're trying to retain a clean, minimalistic finish in your room, ceiling speakers can really help here. Benefit number four continues on from this and that is how much space that you save from having your speakers in the ceiling and the lack of wires and clutter that you therefore get. Now for this reason, ceiling speakers are well suited to family homes where you might be worried about kids knocking over speakers and things like that. On the whole, floor standing speakers, bookshelf speakers, those kinds of things need a dedicated space in your home and can take up quite a bit of space. Not to mention the stress and worry that they could get knocked over when you've got young ones or even dogs running around. So keeping your ceiling speakers up in the ceiling eradicates this issue. Number three is the freedom of positioning that you have for ceiling speakers versus wireless speakers. Now your ceiling almost acts as a completely blank canvas if we exclude lighting, skylights and that sort of thing. This means that you can direct the sound to the room's most habitable areas and create a really nice focused stereo sound. An example would be over a kitchen island that we're seeing a lot more commonly now. You can have a pair over each side of the kitchen island to create a really nice stereo experience. For a wireless speaker, as they're usually front directional, your experience will be significantly affected by where you're sitting in the room. With ceiling speakers, you can put them in the perfect place in your room, and as the drivers face downwards into the room, everyone gets a nice balanced sound throughout the space. A quick little tip as well is to look for a model of ceiling speaker that has either pivotable drivers or pivotable tweeters where you can actually direct the sound to where you want it to go. On the whole, this means that you can actually get more immersion from your ceiling speakers. You can choose to position them exactly where you want in the room to have maximum impact and you can also get ceiling speakers with a wide dispersion to fill more of the space. On to number two then, and this is that ceiling speakers can be a great option for rears in a home cinema setup. Now we often see people who don't want to have their speakers on the wall behind their seating area or they don't have the space for speakers on a floor stand for example. So putting the rears up in the ceiling can be the perfect solution for this. Getting the surround sound from overhead also further adds to the immersion when you're watching movies with that feeling of height channels, almost like you're watching it at the cinema. There will be some people who prefer the experience of in-wall or floor-mounted surrounds, but if they aren't practical in your room, then putting your surrounds up in the ceiling is definitely a solid option. And finally, the number one benefit of in-ceiling speakers is the flexibility that you get. And I'm talking about the broad range of models available at a complete variety of costs. So there really is something out there for everyone. There are options for ambient background listening, right up to high-end hi-fi quality speakers to replace your hi-fi separates. Of course, with most ceiling speakers, you do need to factor in the cost of the amp. But again, you've got a lot of choice there to find the best option for you and your setup. Now I think people are always a little bit cautious of ceiling speakers as they think it's going to be very expensive and yes there are options for those with a much bigger budget. However there are setups available for a more accessible cost. For example you can usually install multiple pairs of speakers on the same amp even if it's single zone like the Sonos amp. Now this works very well in open plan spaces like a kitchen diner where you won't ever be having different music played at the same time. Obviously though, all amps have a maximum number of speakers that you can install on it, so don't go installing 20 speakers on the same amp. You can even use things like speaker switches where you might have an indoor zone and an outdoor zone. Now instead of installing another amp, you can install a speaker switch to simply turn on and off one of the zones at any one time. Another massive cost saving method would be to swap out passive speakers for active speakers. And what I mean by passive speakers are speakers that require a separate amplifier to power them with speaker cable. Active, on the other hand, don't need a separate amplifier and instead just plug into mains power. 
Now, the market leader of active ceiling speakers is a brand called Live Audio. Now, there are Bluetooth and Wi-Fi versions available, so Bluetooth is great if you just want to ping your music straight to the ceiling speakers and not have to worry about an app or anything like that. Whereas Wi-Fi ceiling speakers are great if you're perhaps considering multi-room audio and you want to be able to group multiple speakers around your home whilst using the benefit of an app. Now, of course, everyone's properties are going to be different and everyone's requirements are going to be different. So do get in touch with us if you're based in the UK and you'd like some help with making your budget go as far as possible in your ceiling speaker project. Our ceiling speaker experts are always happy to have a chat and I'll link our design service below for you. So if this video has helped make your mind up and you're thinking about how they might all be set up, do check out our other videos. Here's a playlist we think you'd find handy. Here's a video we think you'll enjoy and here's us if you're not subscribed yet and want to catch our upcoming ceiling speaker content. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.